Uh, let's start with the, the classifications, right? Yes. We're going to discuss Cat 5 to begin with. Right. And usually when somebody asks for Cat 5, they really mean Cat 5E because Cat 5 is obsolete. The difference between what the old Cat 5 was and the Cat 5E mm -hmm. is that it can handle a gig, a gigabit per second. Correct. Which back in the day, that seemed like a lot. So that was basically 10 megabits, megabits. Yep. to 10 100 and then to the gigalands, and you know. Gigs. Here and, we go, gigs. <laughs> yeah. Well, the one thing about it, especially with the Cat 5e cable that we've used previously and built for people, don't forget all of our cabling comes with a lifetime warranty. You know, as we take a look at things and we progress through all sorts of technology, we find ourselves going from Cat 5e, right. making that jump to Cat 6. Right. Which is now becoming the new minimum standard. Yeah. Now, correct. Cat 6, if you have a 5e network, 6 works on a 5e network. Yes, everything is yep. backwards compatible. Right, right. Which is a good thing to remember when you're dealing with copper cabling. You're not going to be able to jump up a step, but you can take a step back. So if your switches are 5E, then Cat6 cable will work. Correct. Um, if it's Cat6 switch, 5E will not work. It will not work. No. Correct. 